Back to that story we first brought you at the top of the newscast. Three Marines killed in an Osprey crash in Australia this weekend were based out of Kaneohe Bay. Three other Marines are now hospitalized. One of them is in critical condition. ABC's Terry Morgan has more in the crash, including newly obtained audio from the moments after the Osprey went down. Two U.S. Osprey MV-22s were on their way to participate in a major multinational training exercise called Predator's Run Sunday morning when one went down over a remote island off Australia's northern coast, the other radioing in. Guard, uh, we are just declaring an emergency in the vicinity of Melville Island. Roger, search and rescue is on the way. Requesting you remain in the area and pass any additional uh, details as they come in, please. Minutes later... Search and rescue is requesting if there's uh, fire. Hey, firm, uh, there is a significant fire in the vicinity of the crash site. The cause of this crash is still unknown. Investigators are expected to remain at the site for days. Tonight, three Marines remain hospitalized. Those Marines who did survive will be able to help investigators figure out what brought this aircraft down. The Osprey has a history of deadly crashes and mechanical problems. Just last year, five Marines in an Osprey were killed during a training exercise outside San Diego in California, and a Marine investigation into that crash has concluded it was caused by mechanical failure. Terry Moran, ABC News, Washington.